Hello everybody, so today we're making My Little Pony Cupcakes. I took six of my, that's four, six of My Little Favorite Ponies and turned them into cupcakes. We got Rarity, we got Fluttershy, Applejack, Rainbow Dash, Twilight Sparkle, and Pinkie Pie. Yep, you see that? I wanted to make sure I got the names right because I felt like you guys would eat me alive in the comments if I didn't. It's also really hot in here. Now this is just one of my three My Little Ponies videos. And these videos are a part of a collaboration with Carla from Cake Bash Studios. We just had Korean barbecue together! I think these cupcakes are adorable, so let's get started. Now to create these cupcakes, I'm using a plain white cupcake batter and I'm just dyeing them several colors. Now I decided that I wanted the cake part of this cupcake to be the eye color of each of the characters. So for Rarity, I'm dyeing her cupcake cake a navy blue. It's like a blue purple navy blue, kind of. I need to go to Home Depot and just collect all of those different samples so I have definitive colors. Applejack, my favorite pony, is getting a Granny Smith apple color. For Twilight Sparkle, I actually thought that there was too much purple, so instead I'm dyeing her cake yellow to match her crown and her like, uh, hooves? Shoes? Horseshoes. Now Pinkie Pie is getting a very vibrant sky blue. And Rainbow Dash is getting like a magenta. A purple magenta. I really need to go to Home Depot, you guys. <laughs> Start plucking out all of those color samples. I'm wearing black gloves because I thought that this would shield me from getting food coloring on my hands. And I was wrong, you guys. I don't know how that happened, but it did. These gloves were a waste. I'm using cupcake liners that are the same colors as all of the cupcake batters. I wish I had a different cupcake pan. This one looks dirty, but I washed it like six times to get all the stains out and nothing worked. Yo, Mata Stewart, can you help me out? Now to make working with a cupcake batter easier, I place them all into Ziploc bags so I can control how much batter goes into each cupcake liner. I place this into the oven and with some YouTube magic, they came out like five seconds afterwards. Now I'm going to set these aside to cool and I'm going to work on some domes. Now I created some buttercream that's the color of all of the ponies. And starting with Rainbow Dash, I'm going to fill the mold with some buttercream and using the back of a spoon, just going to make sure that the icing touches all of the walls of the mold. And this will force a lot of the air bubbles out. And then just level it off with an offset spatula. I'm just going to repeat that process with all of the different colors. I got the dome idea from the scran line. His cupcake game is too strong. He's like, it's like, he's like the Beyonce of cupcakes and I'm like, I'm like Rita Ora. <laughs> I like Rita Ora, but they're just, they're just not on the same level. On a side note, download Rita Ora's new single because I think it's a good song. Now we have one more thing to create before we start piping and putting these babies together. I'm gonna roll out some fondant and using a template I created, I'm gonna cut out some pony ears. You're gonna need two ears for each cupcake. And you're gonna need to match all of your fondant ears to the color of the buttercream you created for that pony. And for Rarity and Twilight Sparkle, you're also going to need to create some unicorn horns. I just rolled out some really long cone shapes and then just spiraled them together to create the unicorn. Now we can put all of these little pony homies together. Now let's start with my favorite pony, Applejack. She's my favorite because I'm in love with the South. I love the South. I love Southern food. I love country music. I'm like one of 10 people in, in Los Angeles that likes country music. <laughs> we have our own club, okay? It's like Illuminati status. Very exclusive, you guys. It's like Costco. Now for Princess Twilight Sparkle, I'm just going to pipe out some purple and pink stripes to match her asymmetrical unicorn pony mane. Then we're going to add her ears and then her unicorn horn. Now for Pinkie Pie, I'm using an Ateco 849 tip. I'm just starting at the top and wrapping it down the left side of the cupcake. And I'm just doing it twice to get all of the volume in her pony mane. Now for Shutterfly, I screwed up just a little bit because I'm using the wrong cupcake. Supposed to be the teal green, but this is the sky blue. I didn't realize until I started editing. Using the same tip I used for Pinkie Pie, I started at the top of the dome and then just worked my way down the left side of the cupcake. Now for Rarity, I'm using a little bit of pink, which is a lie, again, because the toy does not resemble the actual cartoon. Then I'm just using some very deep purple to give her that hair swoop.
But not least, we're gonna add her unicorn horn. Now we got one more, rainbow dash. So I'm adding three colors of buttercream. The first is some orange, then I'm adding two yellow stripes on the side and a dollop of red right at the top to give her her signature main style. And voila! All of my My Little Pony cupcakes are complete. They're done! And they look so pretty. Now I'm curious, which of these cupcakes is your favorite? Now my favorite character is Applejack, but I think that the Pinkie Pie cupcake looks the best. I just like the way that Teco Tip represents her hairstyle. I love you guys, I will see you very soon.